Greetings viewers and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, we just got done talking to Sam Adams and um, now we're... So, we just learned about the tunnels and we just escaped the boss of massacre thing. And um, today, and I don't know what we're going to be doing in this episode, but hopefully it's more missions because I love those. Even though I have no idea what they are. So, uh, hopefully me walking by these guys don't make- okay. In the last episode I learned three ways to help to decrease my notoriety. I hate it when games do this. I hate it when they put two- I hate it when games put two markers, because I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. Out of my way, out of my- oh, did not- okay. Wow! You are way better than, than the Assassin's Creed 2 guards. They would have pummeled me if I ran into them. Sorry guys. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Going too fast. Can't- Okay, so I am supposed to go here. It took me a, a quite a while, I'd say 15 minutes, to find out that I had to go to this place. Come on, Connor, you can go faster than this. Achilles? Welcome back. You left me in Boston. The training we've done here is all well and good, but experience is a better teacher by far. What of my father? Into the wind, I'm afraid. We have to find him. And we will, after the house has been repaired. But he's out there, plotting who knows what. And what would you do when you found him, if you found him? I You're would a with a few uh, months of shame him. For leaving a me at a young age, spent for being a deadly father, and then I kill him. If you're going to stand a chance against the Templars, you're going to need these. Hidden blade? Hidden blade? Please tell me it's a hidden blade. Hidden blade, hidden blade, hidden blade, hidden blade. Yes! Go on before I change my mind. Gar's just excited. As excited about this as I am. Who, who is that guy? Okay, he needs help, so we're automatically gonna rush out as fast as we can, like the Flash. Don't worry, the Assassinator Man is here to assassinate your problems. Sir, please help! He's going to die. What's wrong? Ooh. There's no time. Please come. Okay, I'm following you. Follow Godfrey. I didn't even know that was his name. Down there, he's just passed under the bridge. Do not touch the water while rescuing Terry. That's impossible. Oh gosh, I do not have. Your, I do not. I do not have the time to deal with you. Okay. Oh come on. Go away, dogs. Hey, come back here! I'm coming, bro! I don't have time to deal with you guys. I'm trying to catch up with you, but you're going way too fast. Boom! Rescued. Oh, 
out. <laughs> what this knob end is trying to say is he's forever in your debt, sir. Who are you calling? A knob end? You, because you are one. What were you doing on those logs? One of the dangers of lumbering. We've got the camp set up a few rods off of here. Well, he almost died, timber. so maybe you do a We're different kind of lumbering. Open a mill in the area. There's a good place not far from the manor on the hill where I'm staying. <laughs> I like you already. We'll have a look. Be safe for next time, okay? Okay, so I don't see how we could have beat that without touching the water, but then again, it was an accident, so. I'll miss the peace and quiet, but we can certainly use the wood. The manor needs a lot of work. That and other things. Meet me at the small shack by the shoreline when you have time. There's something else you need to see. Okay. What is it? An asset. So I have a hidden blade now. Oh, you you want me to you want me to tree run all the way over there? Look for the missions icon with this to recruit new settlers and improve your homestead. We also give you new resources to trade and unlock items you can craft. Okay. What? What are these things? Can I talk to you? Are these just people in the woods? Let's go ahead and do some tree running. No, they can't. They can't. Oh. Please tell me he's alive. Oh, you want to do that? Let's disarm you. I need you to not have a weapon. Freak. Where? What stranger? Oh, the guy that was right here. Come on, pull him up, Connor. Thank you. Are you all right? I uh, think so. Didn't do much to me aside from a good scare. Blaggards. No idea what that what word means, but I like it. My purse, which was meager, and they decided to punish me for their trouble. Silly, really. My tools and equipment were worth a king's share to the right man. In any case. I best get on my way. It's a long walk to the nearest inn. I thank you again for your kindness. Have you no home? Oh, well, I was a proud resident of Boston until recently, but I'm not a supporter of his majesty, and, well, I was forced out of my wood shop and home by loyalists. There are plenty around here who could use the services of a skilled craftsman if you were looking for somewhere to settle. Is that right? I may look into that. 
Thank you. Okay, so we saved this homesteader, and now we're going to go meet Archilles. We have to go onto that ship. There better be nothing in the water. I just played Far Cry 3, and I... And I know how scary it is to be in the water. That game gave me aquaphobia. I mean, not like serious, but like just a little bit to where, like, I'm af afraid to go underneath the water into deep water. Because, like, sharks and stuff. Like, it's like a bunch of secrets that were just everywhere and you didn't know where they were coming from. Who's talking? Oh, it's that guy. Okay, I'm here. What do you want me to do? Go away. Who's this guy? Say go away, boy. Not speak the king's English? I do. Oh, I didn't see you there, old man. I'd have set my home in order if I'd known you'd be calling. Your boy's name is Connor. He's here to restore the property. Restore? Restore? Pardon my manners. She's still the fastest in the Atlantic. Sure, she needs some attention. Minor things, mostly, but with a little affection, she'll fly again. Who is she? Who is she? Why, the Aquila boy, the ghost of the North Seas. The boat. A, a boat? She's a ship boy, and make no mistake about it. I thought you brought him here to restore order. I reckon he's the greenest thing on the frontier. Connor. Meet me back at the manor when you finished here. Okay, so what am I doing? You said it requires exactly? repairs. You able? She does need work. A ship is a she, boy. And yes, I can refit her, but I'm lacking in the proper supplies. Some some quality I got you. would help me get started. Got you. I can see to that. How long before it she is able to sail again? Just get me the lumber, boy. I'll raise a crew. Need help with the crew, too? How far is it? Reach Achilles. I thought... Okay, um, I'm here. Ah, there you are. I have something to show you. Come, take a look. What is it? How do we get? How do we get a some legend. timber? It lets us manage. Oh, was I supposed to defense. do something before? Well, you didn't show me. And these? Uh, that was years ago, before the slow fever, before the Templars, before everything collapsed. But that's all in the past. Better we focus on what's in front of us. Take up the ledger, and I'll teach you how it all works. What, le what ledger? The stockpile allows you to purchase items from the homesteaders and display items current in town. Amount to be purchased. Gold Fry and Terry have oak lumber available for purchase. Pre press X to purchase the oak lumber. Okay, the stockpile now contains oak lumber. Press A to leave the stockpile. Select zero to merchant whom the item will be sold. 
Carefully monitor time, risk, tasks, so the way you're depending. Okay, time, 12 minutes. Risk, 35, tax, 30, 30%. Sure. Time passed quickly after that. <clears throat> My days a blur of study, training, and work. What little free time Achilles allowed me was spent learning about the Templars. About Charles Lee and my father. I longed what? to confront them. To put an end to their We're scheme, just turning invisible. You to saw that? my people would remain untroubled. The ship! Free. But I knew it was too soon. That to approach them now would soon be All my work would be for nothing. Patience. Restraint. These proved the most difficult subjects for me. But in time, I mastered them as well. Days became months. Months became years. And as my skills and knowledge grew, so too did I. Hey, have you grown? You don't look... You don't look that different. In fact, if anything, you look younger. You look younger. Okay. Yeah. You guys see that? Look at this baby boy. He looks younger. Maybe it's just because the texture on his face is smooth. Where am I going? Oh, oh. Oh, I'm going onto the ship. Wow, good job, dude. I already forgot your name. Uh, the Aquila must be equipped with cannon at Martha Vineyard. Officer, do you want to start the sample mission? Sure. Why not? I have no clue what I'm doing, so why Come not? Come aboard do it? and feast your eyes, boy. No, 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 no! Not the left foot. Never the left foot. Horrible look. Step with your right foot first. Is that is that true sailor superstition that stepping with your right foot is good luck? Or is that just she is him being obsessive? Solid? Aye. Weatherly and sleek. She'll fetch twelve knots in a stiff gale, near a ship from here to Singapore can outrun her on her best day. What do you say we take her out? Show you what she can do first hand. Where would we go? As it happens, she still needs guns and the officers to command them. We'll launch straight away. <laughs> Don't worry, lad. So are I'll we gonna make steal sure you cannons? Good sea legs. I think we're gonna steal some cannons All from the All in the mainsail! Get up the rigging! Hand over fist! Come on, men! Let's get her out where she needs to be! Uh, only six months took to do this? East Coast, 1773. Okay. This looks cool. Ooh, I want to sing sailor songs. What do you do with a drunken sailor? What do you do with a drunken on, sailor? Lad, no what do you do like with a drunken sailor? I don't know the rest of the lyrics. Oh, wait, I steer? Come on, come on, she won't bite. But I uh, oh no oh 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 uh, oh 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 oh. You're Best. connected to her now. Listen and feel. Half sail. Ah, the killer flies again. Do you feel it, lad? Oh, Set a course for Martha's Vineyard. We'll oh, find our guns it. and officers there. Okay, so that's She's a nimble vessel, but the faster she goes, the more cumbersome she grows. And the firmer your hand needs to be. Enjoy this stretch of open water before we come upon those shallows. Call for full sail if you like. How do I call for full sail? Full sail! Go get that wind! Okay, so full sail makes us go really fast. Half sail shifting. makes us go moderate. Stay alert, Connor. 
Gusty winds can be difficult to manage. Oh gosh, I got this, I got this, I got this. Reduce speed! We need to ease off half sail! I got this. I got this. Oh no, there's another, there, there's a ship right there. Do we need to worry about that? Are we good? Oh, we're good. I want everything. Unfurl everything. Full sail. Now, take us through these shallows. Careful not to run up on them. The sandbars will slow us down, but the rocks will put a hole through a hole. And if you want to make a quick tack, call for half sail. She's more maneuverable then. Okay, I'm already feeling uh, self-conscious about this. Yep, we're going. We need to get to this place as fast as we can. Wow, that is really far away. Who's this guy? I like the little crew we've got. I like how you've made little animations of them doing stuff, because that's really Watch cool. Cliffs, oh crap! Ow, 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 ow. I'm not Ow. ready for Fiddler's Green just Fall yet. Haul in to half sail! I did not mean to do that. I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy. I took damage. Well, I I'm, I'm a big screw. Ease her off! We need to ease off half sail! Oh, wait. According to this, there's a boat right in front of us. Yep. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Full sail. Full no sail now. Double time. Dock at the pier. Drop anchor. Okay. I couldn't hear what they were saying, so... We made it. So we need to equip some, we need to get some cannons. Oh, hello, Miss Mandy. You're looking every bit as ravishing as I remember. Ugh. Hmm. After all these years, you sail all the way to the vineyard to pay me compliments. We are looking for David and Richard Clutterbuck. Hmm. <laughs> nice to see you too. He gave you a compliment, Robert, you're just gonna question Faulkner. them and then be mean when Where he's wrong? Where the hell wrong? you been? He's been Sorry working on shit. like I did, lads, but where I was going, no one could know. You two working much? No. Between contracts at the moment. Well, we're looking for gunnery officers. What would you two say to working with me again? My guess is they're a big no. We'd be for getting into a few more scraps. <laughs> <laughs> Good show. The Aquila is a fine vessel. We're fitting all the guns as we speak. Looks like your friend's about to catch a beating. So where, where is Charles Lee? I don't much care for your tone, boy. Why are you talking to this guy? Hey, you don't want to be doing that, Biddle. Bobby Faulkner turned to wet nursing. <laughs> Could you finally realize you're a sh Sailor. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not in here, gentlemen. Better still, not at all. Bobby, take your friends and get out! Let's go, boys. Our guns ought to be ready. Come on. But I wanted to fight this guy. I wanted to pick a fight with him. He's gonna follow us outside and we're gonna fight him on the... Or not. What the bloody hell was that about? The older man is a Templar. How'd you Who know? Did you see the symbol on his coat? The young buck was Nicholas Biddle. Nobody. Sails before the mast. Midshipman for the crowd. Are the guns ready? Aye, but we won't jump in over our heads. We'll find a suitable target and show you how they work. We've fitted her with a modest amount of guns to start, but rest assured there's ample room to add more should you feel the need. Okay. We're almost here. So are we gonna target? 
Looks like a British frigate with half seas over. Should do nicely for a spotted target practice. Bring around no broadside, and when all guns are on target, call fire. at her bow and do as much damage as possible. Her bow? Good! Now give the swivel up. guns a turn. More precise. Hit those old powder barrels and light up the sky. Hold the release L1 to fire. fire. Boom! So L1 is a single precise cannon, and R1 is to use all cans for maximum damage. But oh crap, oh crap, of course, of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. Destroying property of the ground. I missed every single one of them. Get ready, go! Oh, that was beautiful! Hold on, I, I got something for you. Come on, come on, you got this. Let's go. Get in our line of sight! Oh, that was beautiful. That's a cover. Damage report, officer. Right, sir. Get in my... Okay. Get on my level! Come on, get... Get, get on my level! That's all of them, right? Not bad for your first boy, Jay boy. Yeah, that that was fun. I like that. That was fun. I like that level. I got them, all of them. You get what I need, and I'll give them to you. Simple. You got a ship, could find them all to boot. Who is that man? Him. Some old salt always on about letters he's got from Captain Kidd. Nonsense, really, but he doesn't hurt no one, so I'll leave him be. Talk to him if you fancy, but be warned he'll chew your ear off. Anyway, the Aquila's here for you. If you should get a pang for the open sea, we'll be waiting. Now I implore you to head up the hill before the old man comes out of retirement just for me. Okay, we're gonna talk to the to the men. You weeks. Or not. Not even a goodbye before you lift. Sorry. Well, what are you waiting for? Put them on. We're worthy. We're worthy. Oh. Once upon a time, we had a ceremony on such occasions. But I don't think either of us are really the type for that. 
You have your tools and training, your targets and goals. And now you have your title. Welcome to the Brotherhood, Connor. Connor the Native Assassin. We're worthy! Oh, that's it? Welcome back, Desmond. You'll be happy to hear there's actually good news for once. Yeah? I've managed to locate a power source, and it's relatively close by. Up for a trip to Manhattan? Is it safe to leave? Abstergo's gotta be looking for us. Obviously it's not safe. Can't exactly sit around here hoping to get lucky, though, can we? We need that power source. Besides, I'm sure you can cook up some way to hide our movements. Maybe. The Templars have access to all kinds of satellites and camera systems. We'll need to find a way to mask our digital signature. I can probably camouflage the van, too. But there's not much I can do for us. That's an easy one. Wait, are we gonna play play uh, blah blah? Are we gonna be playing as Desmond for the first time? Oh, 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 we're actually doing this. Are we actually doing this? Are we? We're we're we're, we're actually doing this. Local utility companies have assured the public that they're completely prepared for the upcoming solar maximum. Disruptions to service are expected to be minimal. If only they knew. What's this? A remote operated camera. It'll provide us with a feed while you're on mission. It looks like a fidget spinner. This will let us talk to each other. We're almost there, so listen up. The artifact is in an office penthouse in Lower Manhattan. At this time of night, direct infiltration is going to get you noticed. I think we're better off having you drop in from above. What do you mean, above? Do we have a plane or a helicopter? I doubt we have anything that could get me to fly. Or do we? Heads up. There's no elevator access from here on out. You'll have to get up there the old-fashioned way. I like the old-fashioned way. <laughs> Who needs elevators when you have climbing skills? We're actually playing as Desmond now. This is what I not like. Nice linear uh, levels that tell you exactly where to go. Oh, don't hold still. It's a lovely view. <laughs> Seriously, Sean? F you. Language, Desmond. Where do I go? Here? This is really easy. was not supposed to do that. I thought, okay, I was wrong. <laughs> so we're climbing up. So we're climbing along the wires. This is some uncharted stuff. Jesus. Look on the bright side. No security to worry about. And a not so bright side, the slightest misstep means you're effectively misplaced. Shut up, Sean. What do you mean misstep? What do you mean paste? Oh, you're talking about if I fall? Yeah, I, I got that part, part, Sean. I did not expect that I would be able to climb up that. Okay. The running start. Ooh. I like this. Almost there, Desmond. Once you reach the top of the lit up crane, you should be high enough to make the jump. Should? It'll be fine, don't worry. 
Well, you might want to worry a little. I'm pretty sure she was high when she was running the numbers. Sean! A joke! It was a joke! Okay, I thought his name was Arthur, but apparently his name's Sean. Oh, that's clever. Putting a tarp so I can't climb that that way. This is where I'm going, right? Jump when you're ready, but wait for my signal to open the chute. Timing's really important here. Too soon or too late and you'll miss the building. Why do I have the biggest feeling that I'm about to screw up? Now, open your chute now. I was right, I didn't even see the button and I automatically hit the button. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay, aim for the building, aim for the building, aim for the H, aim for the H. I cannot believe we're playing as Desmond this round. Oh, that's all we get to do? That wasn't so bad. So, you must be Desmond. Not exactly what I expected. But I guess your kind doesn't have many options these days. Who are you? Ask your father. Now give me that. I don't think so. Look, I'm not supposed to kill you, but the boss man didn't say anything about you up. So you got to the top. Please don't curse. So our father knows this guy. Is he our evil uncle? I knew it. Every video game and every TV show has to have one. Can someone please tell me what happened to so Lucy? who the hell is Daniel Cross? Believe it or not, he used to be an assassin. The assassin, the way I've heard it told, but it turned out he was a sleeper agent for Abstergo, programmed to infiltrate and destroy the organization. How did he know you were there? We could be compromised. They must have caught me snooping inside their network and sent Cross to see what we were after. If they were aware of our current location, we'd know. Though, I will say this. Doesn't bode very well for future expeditions. I've set up some cameras topside. If anyone shows up, we'll see it. I'd suggest you go see about finding a socket for that power source. Or we can return to Connor if you prefer. All the artifacts in the world won't mean a thing without the key.